Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Mr. Ian Teaches English. Today is the final in a three-part series about contractions in English and how to pronounce them naturally. I already did a video about the present tense contractions and the past tense contractions. So if you want to practice those, I recommend that you also watch those videos. Uh, it doesn't matter which one you watch first, uh, but they're all important. Now today we're going to talk about the future, the contractions that we use in the future. And this is probably the verb tense that with the most confidence, I can tell you we always use contractions. So we're going to talk about two, three main verb tenses, uh, the future with will. Uh, now the future with going to and the present continuous, you can use the present tense contractions that I already talked about. So we'll talk about simple future with will, the future perfect, and the future perfect continuous, which both use will have. So we'll talk about both of those here um, using the will and using will have. So let's go ahead and begin here. We'll start with I and we'll go down the pronoun list. I will say the full form and I will say the contraction and repeat it three times. This gives you the opportunity to practice and to practice with your mouth. Don't, don't practice in your head. If you want to practice in your head, go watch another video. Um, it is really important that you practice with your mouth. Just like learning to play guitar or learning to play basketball or lifting weights, you have to do the physical work so your body remembers so that it becomes normal for your body to produce these sounds. So here we go. The first one, I will, ow, ow, ow. You will, you'll, you'll, you'll. He will, he'll, he'll, he'll. She will. She'll, she'll, she'll. It will, it'll, it'll, it'll. We will, 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 will. They will, they'll, they'll, they'll. And don't forget, you can also use the uh, apostrophe LL after nouns too, not only pronouns, but also nouns. So you can say Mr. Ian O, my wife O, my teacher O. It's very, very common to use O, uh, especially in the future tense uh, with nouns, with anything really. So the future perfect uses a combination of will and have. So we're gonna put all of it together. Now, when you write, you probably won't write like this, but I promise that it sounds like this when you pronounce it. So when people are speaking, listen for this sound. All right, I will have olive, olive, olive. You will have yolov, yolov, yolov. He will have hillov. Hill of, hill of. She will have, shill of, shill of, shill of. It will have, it'll of, it'll of, it'll of. We will have, will of, will of, will of. They will have, they'll of, they'll of, they'll of. And like I said in my other videos, it is really important to practice these and practice pronouncing these because what you practice pronouncing is what you listen for. So it's really important that you are practicing them correctly. All right, now let's move on to the negatives. So um, I wanted to take a little bit more time on this because there is a little bit of confusion, making mistakes with students where they have a problem 
with the difference between will not, which is won't, and want, like I want candy. Now these are two very different sounds in English and no English speaker has problems with these two sounds. So I'll repeat them here. Um, look at my mouth, make sure that you are shaping your mouth in the same way. So let's talk about will not first. Watch my mouth. Won't, won't, won't. It's got that O, oh, you almost make an O oh with your mouth, won't. Now let's compare that to want. All right, watch how my mouth moves differently. Want, want, want. There's a lot more mouth movement with want. Now I'm gonna go back and forth here a few times. Hopefully you can see the difference in my mouth here. I'll start with will not, won't, and then I'll say want, like I want candy. So won't, want, won't, want, won't, want. So hopefully that helps you in creating these sounds. Now let's go through our pronoun list. I'll say it and then you repeat after me with those three repetitions. I won't, I won't, I won't, you won't, you won't, you won't, he will not, he won't, he won't, he won't, she will not, she won't, she won't, she won't. It will not, it won't, it won't, it won't. We will not, we won't, we won't, we won't. They will not, they won't, they won't, they won't. Let's move on to the negative of have. So again, we're gonna do the same thing with the will have, the affirmative. We're pushing three words together you're not going to write like this, but you will pronounce it like this. So here we go. I will not have. I won't have. I won't have. I won't have. You will not have. You won't have. You won't have. You won't have. He will not have. He won't have. He won't have. He won't have. She will not have. She won't have, she won't have, she won't have. It will not have, it won't have, it won't have, it won't have. We will not have, we won't have, we won't have, we won't have. They will not have, they won't have, they won't have, they won't have. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. I really hope this has been helpful. Um, this series about contraction pronunciation was a request from one of my students because in my class, we always use contractions and they weren't confident in their ability to pronounce them. So I hope that this has been helpful for you. Um, if it has, go ahead and let me know in the comments also. Let me know if there are other pronunciations that give you trouble, maybe comparing sounds or you can't tell the difference between two sounds in English or have difficulty pronouncing them. Let me know. I'm happy to help as your online English teacher. Thank you so much for being here. We'll see you next time. He won't have. He won't have. She won't. She... <laughs> And <laughs> she will not. <sighs> now today, we're going to talk about three different types. <sighs> and it's always these... All right. Um, can, can you hear... Can you hear the, um, the leaf blower outside? <laughs>